Hey, what's up, guys? Nothing We are at the MWC 2014 here in Barcelona, and you're looking at probably the most awaited smartphone this year till now the Samsung Galaxy S5. Now, this is the latest edition in the insanely popular Samsung Galaxy S series. And you see it came out just about a year after the Galaxy S4 was released. Now the S4 wasn't known to be a revolutionary device and the Galaxy S5 also did not exactly stood by the numerous rumors that came out just before the launch of this device in this MWC. It was uh, announced on 24th by Samsung and as you would have imagined it does not have the bleeding 2500 or odd by 600 odd resolution and as a matter of fact it also does not come in the metal casing it's the still almost similar plastic casing as that of the S4 has a, a slightly a different back texture is kind of a dimple texture in fact I, I i would say i like the texture on the s4 better than the s5 it looks cheaper actually for me on top you have the 3.5 mm jack your ir blaster and the mic behind you have a bummed up, bummed up camera from the s4 the 16 mp camera with an led flash and then your speaker grills on the right side you have your power button uh, below you have your micro USB port and then you have um, your mouthpiece also and then on the left side you'd have the volume rocker yeah the Galaxy S5 runs on Android 4.4.2 with a brand new touch switch UI there you can see nice colorful playful round icons of settings there are a hell lot of settings many many items and there you can see it's it's not exactly uh, arranged like in case of 4.4.2 in galaxy note 3 for example they're not arranged horizontally and they also are arranged in grid and not in list you also have the fingerprint scanner that's a new thing on the home screen and then menu and back button yeah so samsung's gonna release an sdk so that people can use the a fingerprint scanner to unlock more things with this unlike the iPhone 5s you can also pay via PayPal and a couple of uh, other applications like Google Wallet they see the system memory it comes in 16 and 32 GB version it will also of course support micro SD card uh, of up to 128 GB that's another new so the Galaxy S5 although does not look that different from the Galaxy S4 and for that matter uh, not radically different than other Samsung devices it's very very advanced on the inside it has a very um, powerful processor uh, it'll come in two variants Snapdragon 801 create 402.5 gig quad core processor and an Exynos version from the uh, for the Asian market where it will have one quad core uh, um, I mean four cores of 2.1 gig and then four cores of 1.5 gig those are the main app menu they see the 2 MP front camera and I showed you the home button the icons also are different and it can connect to the gear Samsung also released the Galaxy Gear 2 that will work on S5 and some other Galaxy devices as well you have the smart remote as usual uh, it's already synchronized to the Samsung TVs here in Spain but it supports almost all countries in the world you see the usual Google Android apps there Chrome Gmail Gmap or play music and drives and all stuff you have Flipboard that's always there and um, as you've seen earlier in the video the flipboard like the note tree does not now come up from uh, below it actually scrolls towards the right from the left much like the blink feed in the HTC one and then you have folder with all the Google apps arranged Chrome yeah. so it should be the same Chrome version 33 that came with Android uh, 4.4.2 
styler and contact page does not change much no? same call and messaging shortcuts that's the 16 MP back camera with an LED flash it's pretty fast you see it acquires the autofocus lightningly fast and radically fast than the S4 or even the Note 3 you have all this uh, modes and stuff you have burst mode and then uh, you know what not and Samsung's trying to consolidate the modes um, to make it easier for the users you see not not lag at all it's it's blazing fast the still yeah oh. now it can also um, record 4k video at 30 fps and then full HD at 60 FPS now but to then to play 4k videos you would need a 4k device like some of Samsung's TVs that can play 4k content you cannot probably play them on any PCs because I'm not sure whether there is any PC with a 4k resolution available in the market right now yeah your gallery typical gallery very very similar to the uh, usual touch with UI galleries so not much touch up on that front the animation of scrolling or home screen slightly different you see again s health also the ui is slightly different than that on the note 3 dialer is big enough and usual and some other usual samsung in-house apps like s voice i've never seen this intro before so as I came to believe Samsung is trying to make the S5 peppier and more youthful and more you know consumer friendly and um, you know kind of than, than the other devices then let's say uh, the Note series so Samsung is pro probably trying to uh, have a clear differentiation between the Note and the S series the Note uh, series is more serious towards the business users and then S for more the consumers again the dimple back I really hate the back seriously the back can be removed and it's also made of plastic yeah so that's the Samsung Galaxy S5 there there you see my magazine yeah. Now Samsung says it's going to be available in spring so that means sometimes in April and uh, um, knowing Samsung's track record it should come to India also in April or at the max um, by the second week of May. Now the pricing is not released yet. In US probably on contract you would get it for about $299 or $259 to start with. India I assume it would be closer to about 50 k where the Note 3 started. But then the Galaxy S5 after all it's not a revolutionary device although it's the, definitely the most powerful Samsung device and probably one of the most powerful smartphones available today but then it's nothing like the rumor said at least from the point of view of the look build and size uh, it has a 5.1 um, inch screen a full HD the rumor said it would be about the retina about like the retina display on the iPad like 2500 odd by 600 odd resolution uh, the rumor also said it would be matte leak. We really wished the Galaxy S5 was matte leak because there was one thing that we missed in all Samsung devices till now. Thank you.